See that guy right there. Hey, you. Well, GG. He's heating up. Hey guys, it's Vash. Welcome back to Hitman 2. We're going back to Miami. Going to Miami. We're going back to Miami because today, ladies and gents, we're doing explosion. Ex explosion. I can't read. It's 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 two in the morning. I'm sorry. We're doing explosive lesions, liaisons, lesions, lesions. I guess I don't know. I can't pronounce that word. I can't read. Uh, redacted means that it is a hidden. There's actually a couple redacted ones. Um, this one's redacted. Hotshot. That's annoying. Hotshot's really annoying. This one isn't too bad. Um. Looks like there's only two redacted ones. I guess those are secret kills to an extent, sort of. They require a bit of a setup to do, but we're going to do this one today. Uh, so yeah, go ahead and you guys, you guys ready to go on a field trip? Cruising down on Main Street. We're, it's, it's time to do it. We're going to go vanilla. We're going to take our normal gun, fiber wire coin. Um, it's funny because when I play this game normally, I, I'd be changing all up my gear. Look at all this gear I got, like bringing that lockpick. <laughs> And starting the different event locations, but we're gonna we're gonna go vanilla because I know how important that is to people, I guess. But yeah, let's do it, boys. Let's do it. Sierra Knox and Robert Knox. I really like this level a lot. If you haven't noticed, I've actually I've played the first three, so Santa Fortuna and uh, what's the third level called? Mumbai. Oh my god. They're really fun so far. I'm really I haven't played a bad level yet. I haven't played a level that I disliked. Okay, so with this one we actually have to be really quick. Cause if you're not fast enough, you uh, it's, it gets it gets a little hard. You have to sneak through the security office, and if you don't get there as fast as possible, yeah. the security guards kinda mess up their placement and it gets a little messy in there. But if you get there as fast as you can, it's actually pretty simple. So we gotta get her out of the way, go through, get into this security office. Now we have to grab the, uh, it's like the safe combination, which is in this room. That guard always gives me bubble guts. Cause if you get here too late, he will see you every single time. Combination lock, okay. So this is where we find the bomb and the note to Robert Knox. As I mentioned before, they asked me to deliver a package. So Robert Knox hired a uh, a racer dude. I, I can't remember what they call one of one of the tech guys. What are they called? The car mechanics. They hired a car mechanic to blow up. Uh, what's his name? Moses Lee, right? Colin Farrell to blow up Colin Farrell's car. But we're we're gonna do the old switcheroo. We're gonna do the old switcheroo. So we are going to then head down to uh, what's her name? Sierra. We're gonna head down over to her part of the woods. Um, and we need one of the costumes, so we're gonna turn that off. And then wait, and we need to get his costume so we can plant this bomb. Cruising down on Main Street! Come on, bro, come fix the generator so I can fix my, uh, oh, look at age 47 cocking his fists. About the Superman punch him. Not really, we're just gonna choke him out. Okay, come on, big boy. Come on, big zaddy. All right, change clothes. We're good. We're gravy, baby. Turn the generator back on, because if you don't, people are going to just keep going over and looking at the generator and just being annoying. You, you're the junior slip wrench who got injured yesterday, right? Suppose I am. Great, this is your lucky day. Do well and there's a bonus in it. Got it? Got it. All right, everyone, look hey, alive and get to your stations. See hey, your butt's dirty. For a last minute pit stop and I need you ready and able. You, rookie, get into position. Got it. So we gotta install install the remote explosive. Oh boy, remote explosive's my favorite. Everyone on your stations, now! Cruising down the main street. Hope you guys are all doing great. I'm in a really chipper mood. I need to take a bath. I'm gonna do that right after this, after we blow this worming up. Well, after her daddy blow her up, we ain't doing nothing. Okay, 
now that that's all set, we need to grab the key over here on the counter and move, make our way to the other uh, area because we need to get a yellow mechanics. We need to get a Moses Lee costume. Not exactly Moses Lee, but we need uh, one of their mechanic costumes. So what we're going to do is, same idea, turn off the generator, and we're going to hide in this closet. And then we're going we gonna to bust his ass in the head with this hammer. Oh boy. Up and running. Drink! Turn the generator back on. Because then you'll attract more unwanted attention. Okay. Perfect. Now, we need to make our way back. Oh, don't worry about the camera thing. We can handle that later. We need to make our way back to the front of the park uh, where we started. We're going to head back that way, which is this way. Take a left. I always usually have a problem. There's like a guard walking up and down this side area. That's a little tough to get around, but low-key, you can just kind of... Oh, he's not here. Unless he's around the corner. Yeah, he's right there. We can hurry up. Perfect. Perfect. Wonderful, baby, wonderful. So the next step to getting this assassination done is we need to call Robert Knox. And that's another reason why you want to make sure you start with your three coins, because you need them to make phone calls and pay phones. So let's go ahead and call Robert Knox. I find it funny how he says, meet me over at the overpass, when there's two overpasses, but whatever. Uh, if you do end up not bringing the, uh, the coins, you can actually find three coins, or two coins, in the Kromstadt area, uh, to the right of the car that you can use to blow up Robert. Uh, it's just sitting on a table in the back. But we need to get rid of that camera. Even though we got seen before, but whatever. I just do it out of habit. Before we leave, we're going to destroy the camera equipment, though. Because why not? Might as well. So this is the overpass you have to meet him at. The other overpass, as you guys know, is the one we use a lot to get from point A to point B. The one way down there. It would have been nice if he told you which one he's at, but I guess they assume that you know to go to this one, because this one's actually connected to the Promstad building. The other one isn't. But we gotta wait for home dude to show up, because he's gonna deech eagle his own daughter. Hi. What's up? Mr. Smith, a pleasure. Do you have the trigger? Boy, do I. Right here, sir. Thank you. Tomorrow's papers will surely just write this off as a terrorist militia attack on some rich corporate CEO. But hey, Grease Monkey, keep it real. It's my business, dude. Oh, I'm gonna watch this. Tell your homie to leave. Leave me. I need to be alone for a moment. Yes, sir. Give me my privacy. I'm gonna take out this hammer. Just in case. And this is where we watch the magic happen, boys. Is she coming? Nope. <laughs> is she coming? Oh, here she comes. It's time for you to help your daughter win. Take out Moses Lee. Oops! My bad. Next up, See you, nerd. Okay, so we're gonna escape out of the roof. You know, as a matter of fact, might not be a bad idea. Might as well. What are they searching for? I want the hammer. Give me the gun. Uh, what we could do, let's see, go this way, boom, 
boom, boom, boom, boom, boom, boom, boom. I'm gonna do some really super sneaky stuff. You guys ready for some like pro strats? This is like the super pro strats. You guys ready? Oh my God. I believe that took out the uh Oops, what am I doing? I think that took out the uh Did I? Is it broke? Oh, it, oh! Yeah, I did. I just wanted to make sure. I, I, it probably said it. Engage all. Engage these nuts, dude. We out. I should have waited. It's fine. We should have waited, but it's okay. Because then that just defeats the whole purpose of shooting it. <laughs> I should have waited. It's all right. It's not that big a deal. How many extra points was that? Like four. Whatever. The point is, is that we got in, we did what we needed to do, and we got out. Oh, we got a four star though. Hmm. That works out. Well, there you go. Oh, we hit level seventy too. Awesome. No, we don't want to watch dead ends again. Let me see. Now, I know we've been hanging out a lot in Miami, and it's because I really like Miami, but we've pretty much done uh, the majority of the kills that I wanted to do. The only ones that I want to do... See, I don't want to do this one again, because we did that in the beta already. I already showed you guys that one. I want to do the chili shot one, the hot shot one. <sighs> Even though I don't like it, but we're, we're, we're going to do the hot shot. And I want to do this one, the pink menace. So, I think upcoming, soon... To let you guys know what's coming soon is uh, we're probably going to do... I can't do both of these because these are both Sierra kills. So I can't do both of these in one go. Um, I guess we could... Uh, hmm. I don't know. What should we do next? Because I want to show these off. Man, I guess we don't have to do a whole video on it. I guess I can just show you guys... The chunks. I do know that I, there's a few Easter eggs in this level that I want to show you. There's uh, three of them. There's three different Easter eggs that I want to show you guys before we jump onto the next area. But I want to show you these two kills. So I guess we'll do both of these, but we have to choose other ways to kill Robert. Uh, I don't know about you, but the man in the sea is my personal favorite. But um, yeah, I think we can actually go to an overpass and end up just sniping both of them. Hmm. Yeah, we probably could. So yeah, next time we uh, spend some time together, we're going to do Hot Shot first. And then Pink Menace kind of ties in with one of the Easter eggs. So we might do Pink Menace at the same time. Well, can we? I don't know if it's possible. I don't know. We'll see. We're definitely for sure doing Hot Shot, though. And then if you guys want to see Pink Menace, we'll do Pink Menace. Because I don't think I've shown you guys that one yet. And that one is pretty funny. Especially when you like find a baseball bat. I think it's really funny. <laughs> I like Miami, okay? I'm sorry that I've spent so much time in Miami, but it's fun. Because then after we finish Miami, we're, where are we going? Yeah, let me back out. After we finish Miami, we're going to Santa Fortuna, which is pretty fun too. So we're going to spend some time in Santa Fortuna. I just want to give, you know, keep the options. Keep the options open. Yeah. Three headed serpent. Boy, that one's funny. We're gonna do Three-Headed Serpent. Oh, I'm excited. I really like it. I've been playing a lot of Mumbai lately. Ooh, this one's pretty fun, too. You guys are gonna love when we get to Mumbai. I'm really excited. This is a lot of fun. I'm really enjoying Hitman, too. I really like it. I like it way better than the first game. Because in the first game, let's go down the list. I, I thought Paris was okay. I loved Sapienza. I hated Marrakesh. Bangkok was fun. I hated Colorado and Hokkaido was okay. But so far we're three levels in Hitman 2 and I like I really like all three of them. So yeah, I'm super hyped to continue on. But thank you guys for hanging out with me. It's like 2:15 in the morning. Uh I'm going to I think we're going to go with Amazon Lush tonight in the bathtub. Lush Amazon, my bad. We're going to light the Lush Amazon candle. We're going to take a bath and cruise on down, make sure we're going to hang out. So thank you guys.
for hanging out. I really appreciate it. Hope you guys are enjoying Hitman 2 as much as I am. I need to do the Undying Elusive Target because I want to kill Sean Bean. I eventually need to do that. I got six days. <laughs> six whole ass days to get it done. But it'll be fine. We'll do it. I just hate the Elusive Target point. I'm only doing it because I just I really like Sean Bean. Um, but I, I hate the way they do the elusive targets, how you can only do it once, whether you win or lose, it's just ogre. That's lame. That's super lame. But, hope you guys all have a wonderful day, a beautiful afternoon, an awesome night, and I will see you guys next time on Hitman.